It is not always necessary to spend money in order to make money. There are websites that can assist you in starting a side gig to produce regular part-time income, or if you're searching for some quick extra cash. Whether you're wanting to make some additional cash quickly or establish a long-term income stream, each of the following websites has benefits geared to your requirements and interests. Upwork. Upwork is simply a networking platform that allows businesses and freelancers from all around the world to connect and collaborate on specific projects. Businesses engage freelancers for a range of tasks, including writing, web design, SEO campaign management, and pretty much any other task that can be completed on a computer. Upwork charges a commission ranging from 5% to 20%, however the more money you earn, the lower the commission. Fiverr. This is another popular website that freelancers may find useful. Do you have any experience with digital animation? You can earn some extra money by working for someone who lacks these talents. Even better, for quick pay, you might offer to gather web research for someone. The site can help you make a lot of money. Make sure your Fiverr profile and gig descriptions are effectively written and communicate the value of the services you're giving to stay ahead of the competition. When someone contacts you, respond as promptly as possible and follow up on their inquiry by asking good questions. A fast, yet well-written response will greatly boost your chances of being hired. Etsy Etsy is the place to market your stuff if you're artistic and can design unique jewelry or refrigerator magnets. The site is simple to navigate and set up a shop on. TaskRabbit Are you willing to get your hands filthy in order to help others? People use this service to find people who are eager to help them with things like putting together a bookcase, cleaning their garage, or running errands. You can do as many chores as you desire, and this may turn into a full-time, or part-time, employment. You can apply for tasks, but you can also create a profile that describes what tasks you're available for and proficient at, and people may find you. Wonder When people need research done, they flock to our site. Although Wonder does not recruit just anyone, you are welcome to apply. According to the website, the procedure takes roughly 5 minutes. You'll gain access to Wonder's dashboard if Wonder believes you have the skills to conduct study. After that, you can select to respond to a question posed by a company leader or a book author. Researchers claim to earn between $8 and $16 every detailed answer, while job sites claim that researchers can earn around $20 per hour. In short, Wonder is a great opportunity for those who appreciate the process of conducting research rather than just looking for a quick buck. ThreadUp This e-commerce website appeals to thrifty folks looking to make money and sell their clutter for cash with the phrase second-hand clothes, first-hand pleasure. Women's and children's clothing are available at the online second-hand store. The following is how it works. You send your clothes in a ThreadUp bag with a prepaid postage label and ThreadUp determines how much they are worth. They're seeking for quality garments and well-known brands, and keep in mind that if your products aren't accepted, you'll be charged a price. So, if you have clothes that would be better suited for a yard sale, host one. ThreadUp, on the other hand, allows you to sell high-quality clothing that you no longer want, and may even pay you enough to acquire new threads. It's a simple procedure. If you want, ThreadUp will send you a prepaid bag to place your things in, or a postage label. Swap. Swap is an online consignment store similar to ThreadUp. Swap will sell your worn clothes, toys, and games after you send them in. When it comes to how much you can make, the website adds that if item is priced under $10, you'll get a 30% credit to use on Swap.com, or a cash refund of 20% of the sale price. If your item sells for between $10 and $20, you'll get a 50% credit, or a 40% cash refund. If it sells for more than $20, you'll get a 70% credit, or a 60% cash payment. It's more convenient than, instance, selling on Facebook Marketplace, where you usually have to meet someone in person to give off an item. Apart from gathering items in your home, and placing them in a prepaid box supplied to you, the process is rather simple. Gazelle. You can sell your devices here if you have an old cell phone or other equipment, Think iPads and PCs. For your device, the website will make you a cash offer. If you agree, packaging materials will be delivered to you. Gazelle will cover the shipping charges, and you will receive a check, a gift card, 
or cash deposited to your PayPal account. You won't make a fortune, but it's better than having an unneeded equipment sit on a shelf collecting dust and selling it is considerably better for the environment than throwing it out in a landfill. It's a rather straightforward procedure from start to finish, as you might anticipate. Card Sell This is a well-known website for buying and selling gift cards. Perhaps some of the gift cards you received last Christmas have lain and used, and you don't expect to use them. Tell Card Sell what you have, and they'll give you an offer, which you can accept or reject in exchange for cash or, ironically, another gift card. There is no price for mailing your gift cards to Card Sell and the process is straightforward. Offer up. If you don't have the time or energy to have a yard sale, offer up could be a good substitute. After you take a picture of what you have and set a price, someone nearby will hopefully see it online, fall in love with it, send you a note, and you'll meet, in a public area, as offer up encourages, to get your money. However, offer up also provides options for sending products to purchasers via mail. Although OfferUp is frequently compared to Craigslist, some users think it is a simpler site to use. This is likely due to the fact that if you download the app, you can instantly communicate buyers and sellers, and members have profiles, allowing you to verify that they are who they say they are. If someone has received one of OfferUp's badges, it's a solid indication that they're a trusted, reliable seller on the platform. Nonetheless, you should use caution when buying and selling OfferUp things in public places. Neighbor is there enough storage space in your home? Perhaps an unused garage or storage shed? You may use neighbor.com to sign up and volunteer to keep your neighbor's belongings. For the self-storage industry, it's akin to Airbnb. You don't have to pay anything and can pick your own prices. The person who hires your space will pay a service fee to neighbor.com for bringing you together. Plus, if everything goes well, you'll be motivated to clean up your attic or garage. You can choose to get paid by direct deposit or by receiving a debit card at the end of the month. For utilizing the neighbor website, certain modest fees are deducted from your payment, a processing fee of 4.9% of the total reservation plus 30 cents per payout. Merch by Amazon. You can sometimes supplement your income by designing t-shirt designs. You can sell on Amazon's merch as well as other sites like as redbubble.com. You can simply upload your designs and be compensated for them. Graphic artists can upload t-shirt designs and then sit back and relax. You'll get paid a royalty for each one of your designs that sells, and you won't have to deal with returns, customer care, or shipping. As always thank you for watching, if you like this video give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and ring the notification bell so you won't miss out any of my future videos.